Hey guys and welcome back to another Unreal Engine 4 tutorial. Today I'm going to be showing you how to make a hole in your landscape so that you can build something underneath like a little cave system or anything you want. So to start with I'm going to show you how to create a landscape and the material for it. So if you've already got all this and you want to make the hole then you can skip ahead further in the video which the timestamp for that will be on screen now. But first off I'm just going to delete all of these and then go over to the landscape tab up the top left up here and then get the perfect size that I want. So I think the default of this doesn't look too bad, not too big, not too small. The overall resolution is the size, so this is 500 meters by 500 meters. So now before we do this, we're gonna to want to put the material in here. So I'm just gonna be using the start content textures. So I'm just gonna right click here, hit material and call this landscape matte. And obviously you can do different things with different textures and your own stuff, but I'm going to be using the start content. So you go to start content and textures, and then I'll find a nice grass one. And obviously you can just use the grass material, but I'm showing you how to put the textures into a material yourself if you're using your own ones. So I think this grass one here looks good. So if you just click on it and then open up the material again, hold down T and left click, that puts in the texture sample of that texture. Well, it didn't work for some reason, so we can just search for it down here. So we just search for grass and I'll get ground grass diffuse, put that into the base color, and then just to make it look a bit better, I'll get the normal map as well. So grass, ground grass N for normal, and plug that into the normal map like so. And here we now just have our basic grass material for our landscape. So if we apply that and close it, and then up the material up here, search for landscape map or whatever you just called it and put that in there like so and then hit create and then we'll just wait for this to compile and here we are we now have our very own grass it's very simple doesn't look that good but it works so now what we want to do is open up our material again like this and then click off everything down the bottom left down here where it says blend mode opaque we're going to want to set it change this to masked like so and now we have the opacity mask as well. So now if we just right click and search for landscape visibility mask like so, put that in and it simply just plug that in to the opacity mask like so, and hit apply. And then if we close this, wait for the shaders to compile and then find a spot in our landscape that we want to make a hole, we can now do that. So there we are, the shaders are compiled. I'll go find a spot, I'll do it here. I'll put down the brush size just a little bit and then up here where it says the sculpt tool, you're gonna to click on that and go down to visibility. And then if you just hold left click on a certain spot you wanna make the hole, just wait for the shaders to compile and you can see you now have a hole. And this can be used for multiple things. You can make a little lake or a pond or something, or you can make a cave system so you can go down, or if you just want a basement or something to go through the landscape, you now can. So if we hit play and walk over there, you can see that we have a hole. So if we're just walking on here, that's fine. And then this is a hole into the endless void because I've put nothing underneath there. And just to prove that we fall off, we do just fall into it. And they did actually kill the character as well because of the default settings on the third person example map. So there we go. I think that'll be it for this video because we've managed to put a hole in the landscape. It is extremely simple as you can see. So thank you for watching. I hope you found it helpful and hope you enjoyed. And if you did, make sure to like and subscribe down below. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one.